What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. It's time to take this MacBook from zero to hero. All right, hey, I've got my MacBook Pro. This is a 13 inch, I think it's a 2017 model. And I just picked up this, it's from Skin It. It is a vinyl decal. And as you can see, it is emblazoned with the finest NFL team that's ever existed. Uh, the Detroit Lions since 1934. Now, if you're wondering why not, that says 1934. Um, the Lions were actually something before then before they were lions like this Portsmouth something or something like that. But anyway, uh, but 1934 is the correct year for the existence of the lions. You can see here it comes on this big sheet, and it is kiss cut here. There is also, and I will say that I think this is on all the skin it decals. As you can see, there is a cutout here for the Apple logo. So if you want your Apple logo to show through, you can remove that middle cutout. Now, I am kind of torn whether I will or not. We'll just see. We're gonna get into it and we're, we're just gonna see. So you do wanna make sure it's all cleaned off here and uh, you know wipe it down, maybe a little isopropyl alcohol or whatnot. But then you just start peeling this away. Now my suggestion on this usually is I kind of peel away a little bit, like maybe even a corner or the edge like this and then just fold this back so I don't have the whole thing showing. And then I lay it down, line it up as best I can and then use that edge to start uh, push that down and kind of press it down as I'm pulling this away so that I don't get any air bubbles. Let me see if I can demonstrate. Oh, I'm gonna try to line this up. It looks like it should be a pretty precise fit because if it's not lined up here, it's not gonna line up anywhere else. And I think, <clears throat> I hope I've got it. So I'm gonna start that edge just like that. And now I'm gonna roll out this whole thing all the way, just like this. As you can see, and you can use this little squeegee. You wanna take your time. Uh, like I said, get it right. You can use a pin or a tack or something to kind of pop bubbles. You can kind of squeegee them out to the outside. But, you know, like I said, if you do it right the first time, then you don't have to sweat it. Now, I will say what's happening here is as I'm pulling away the backing, the Apple logo is coming with it. So I'm actually going to just take that as a sign from above, and I'm going to punch out the rest of this Apple logo. Uh, so that I can show off my MacBook Pride. Since it's already happening, that's fine. Now I got it all on there, kind of push down the edges. The nice thing about the MacBooks is they have kind of a soft roll towards the edge, but uh, the vinyl seems to stretch and just uh, kind of form without having to add any heat, which is nice. Now I will say, I started on this end and I tried to be really, really close to that edge. I'm not as sure that you're gonna be able to see that, but I was really close. like half a millimeter to the edge. I could have probably pulled it away a full millimeter because on this side, I'm a little bit short, but that's kind of, you know, horseshoes and hand grenades. Uh, top and the bottom edge I got almost perfectly, but you can see here on the logo, what I've got is a little bit of silver bleeding through there because I just started a little bit uh, closer to this edge then. I probably should have to be super, super precise. Now everything's sticking down there. And as you can see here, when I'm out computing now, you are going to be able to see that um, this is a computer that has a little bit of Detroit pride. If you want to pick this up, this thing was under 30 bucks. You can get a lot of different decals from Skinit for a lot of different devices, but I picked this one up on Amazon itself. So I'll put a link to it in the description. Peter Von Panda, out.